go! 2007 Ford Escape, how to remove the stock radio. Because nobody likes a stock radio. It smells like soup. You need yourself some of these. What are those? They're radio removal tools. Do you really need them? Unless you've got a coat hanger. I mean, some people have metal coat hangers. How else are you supposed to do backroom abortions? Oh, oh that's going to offend someone. <laughs> these just click in, click in. You feel that click. You can hear that. Oh, they just go in and grab, do they? Outward. Do, do you have to pull sideways? Because it appeared you pulled both of the things I sideways. Did. If you look at the side here when I'm doing oh, that. Oh, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. When you push it sideways, it pushes this little clippy bit in. Which allows it to slide out. If your shit's all beat up and sometimes you don't even need these, I don't know how beat up this one is. Apparently not beat up enough that you could just pull it out. I'll show you this again in slow motion. Super slow motion. Now done by editing. We just need to do that slow motion bit in post, right? Yeah. That's, yeah. that's what the people say. Okay. And the antenna. <clears throat> Where's the Ford? It's the, you know, your Ford antenna thing. Ford antenna thingy. Okay. I don't know why it's orange, but... It's orange because it wants to be. Don't assume it's color. There's your factory. Harness. Plug. Just put this. Go to Yank, bro. You got it flip this over, you can see somebody's already been here before and broke the tit off the clip. Oh, there's a fucking tit on that. But stay in there. Stay in that shot. What if you use some sort of pry tool? Perhaps like not. Like not a crowbar? Perhaps not that one. That one doesn't seem to work. Use your, your case. Pops right out of there. Yeah, just use your keys. It's fine. It'll do. That's what the back looks. I don't know what that other hole's for. Oh, probably uh, there was a factory sub and amp option. I was gonna say pooping. Oh well. No, whatever. Either so that's, that's how you remove the factory stereo. And here's how you put it back in. Here's <laughs> how you install a factory stereo. <laughs> <laughs> Look for my next video on how to re how to install a factory stereo. Yeah. And ta-da! It probably still works. So how much did you buy those little tools for? Uh, I think they were like two dollars. Like two dollars? Man, I can afford two dollars. Works just good. Yeah, it works just good. Just just good. Not great. Just good. I mean, <clears throat> again, that's what they look like. There's little U-shapes with like bendy bits. Coat hanger will work. Metal coat hanger, obviously not plastic. Yeah, plastic ain't gonna work. You're just gonna get plastic bits all up in your radio. You can buy these and the other style in a kit and a big kit. Like, exactly. You can buy them at Walmart. Yeah. <gasps> buy them at your local Walmart. Insert Walmart commercial. I wonder if they will buy commercial. <laughs> yeah, they'll buy a time slot in our video. So that's the end of that video. So that's the end of that video.